It is Friday and that means it is time for our SoCal Spotlight. This morning we're heading to the city of Yorba Linda. It's known as the land of gracious living and it's consistently ranked as one of the best small cities in America. And that's where we find our Sheba Turk live this morning. Sheba, take it away. Good morning, Rachel. That's right. This area was once an agricultural community, but it has developed into a residential community with a very unique historic district. Take a look. Southern Californians think of Yorba Linda, they think of President Richard Nixon. His birthplace is now a National Historic Landmark and his Presidential Library and Museum are also located in the city. The Nixon Library and Museum, it's probably, well, it is voted the number one museum in Orange County and probably the top in the nation. It is an outstanding facility. But while the museum can take a full weekend to explore, there are also plenty of other things to do. We have outstanding school system. We have beautiful homes, well landscaped properties, a lot of parks and beautiful trails. We have over 100 miles of hiking, walking, equestrian trails in our city. Yorba Linda also has 22 parks within the city limit. The most popular is the recently renovated Adventure Playground, which offers park goers a zip line, a water slide, a maze area, and a tree house. And a fun fact. We have more houses of worship than any other city in the, in the county. So we're faith-based, we've put a lot of strength in our families and opportunities for our families to work, play, and, and have fun together. Mayor Hernandez says many are surprised that Yorba Linda is what he calls a cultural mosaic. Demographically, the majority is, is, is white, but that's not a large majority. We have then a high Asian population, we have a Hispanic population, and a much smaller African-American population. Uh, we have a large Indian population, believe it or not from India. And it has also been ranked one of the richest cities in America with residents earning a median income over $120,000 per year. Mayor Hernandez left us with a final word of advice. Come to the city and you'll fall in love with it. It's a beautiful city. It's welcoming, inviting, and very friendly. So as you heard there, most people are familiar with Yorba Linda because it is the birthplace of Richard Nixon. So we're going to start taking you around this nine-acre campus, which is his presidential library and museum, and the home that he was born in, which is now a National Historic Landmark. We're going to take you all around this morning. Stick with us. All right. Can't wait. Sheba, thank you.